Louisiana locks up twice as many prisoners as the national average, and reentry programs have shown to help bring that number down. Now, budget cuts have made keeping those programs a lot tougher, but there is some hope. Local 33's Lauren McCoy takes a look at one of those programs making a big impact right here in the capital city. I've been out of prison for two years, and I picked up my two-year chip, and I, I keep it in my pocket just for a reminder. You know, that I'm never going back to alcohol and drugs again. Stephen Coco, Reginald Rome, and Lawrence Martin all have things in common. One of those, they all spent time in our state's prison system. I've been convicted four times, you know, so it's like right now in my life, it's like a blessing to even be free. However, change did come for all of them right here at the Baton Rouge Day Reporting Center. Like I said, this program has took me a long way. This program has took me so far, I have never in my life ever landed a job where I made over $10 an hour. I'm president employed making $15 an hour working at a piping company, thanks to this company. The secretary of the Department of Public Safety and Corrections listened to stories like Rome's and took a tour to see firsthand how much these programs are needed in this community. You know, we, we unfortunately lost four of these in the budget cuts last year. So our, our initiative right now is to get those back. And, and I'm hoping, and really, it, it's a cost saver. It, it's no question about it. If, if, you know, we had to cut these because we had no choice, but ultimately you end up spending more money for more people in prison. We teach them resumes. Uh, we also teach them social skills, life skills, um, how to shake an interviewer hand, how to, you know, say yes ma'am and no ma'am. Just small, soft skills that they all should know, but we just reintegrate and make sure that they know these certain things. My mother passed away. I couldn't even attend her funeral. Couldn't even tell her goodbye. And I was just wondering if she was living today, she'd be proud of me. In Baton Rouge, Lauren McCoy, Local 33 News. Oh, by the way, the program lasts at least 90 days, and the center works with up to 50 ex-offenders at one time. If you'd like to learn more about reentry services here in the Baton Rouge area, just head to our website, brproud.com.